Hey guys, what's going on? It's Sorful here, and sorry, let me just slow down my volume, it's probably killing your ears by now. And I'm going to be showing you guys a trio, kind of a duo, because I have that same zero. Uh, I'm going to be showing you a trio slash duo of Chaos Pierre. Let's see how it turns out. Heard he's a lot harder now, we're going to find out for ourselves if that is indeed what the case is. And boom, that's one death for Santa. And I'm just going to use this skill because I don't want to be knocked back as much. Thank you, go after the puppet please, and thank you. So far, so decent, I suppose. I gotta go sharp eyes, Haiti. Real soon, go right now. So our damage is looking really good so far. He's not difficult for the first 25%. He's extremely easy actually for the first 25%. But then once you get him down to about 75%, he starts switching colors and yeah it takes a lot longer to kill him also whenever you go on hats it's pretty annoying especially if your hands are cold clicking those arrow keys back and forth will definitely <laughs> take a lot if your your hands are cold so what I usually do when we have a full party is I stay in the corner when he has aggro on me and I just tank all the hits while attacking him so he stays on me and my my teammates could just keep wailing at him from behind so exactly what I'm doing now is what I usually do in the you know when I have a full party here because it saves a lot of time and it just allows my entire team to dish out all their damage on him without really having to worry um, about being hit in return and since I have a lot of HP I'm like a tank I could uh, I could tank it no problem the reason why I don't want to do it right now is because I'm one of our I'm I'm our second main damage source right now. And yeah, we kinda need my damage. Could you like let me buff you fucking clown, you piece of a shit? I'm gonna tell the zero to do that. Zero if you have egg. Uh I thought I made it out. Every time I type a sentence. So right there. So now me and um, Santa could just wail on him since we're two main damage sources. And as you can see, if you look at the health bar, things will just go so much more smoothly and so much quicker like this. Um, not everybody does this method. I, I think it should be done by everybody because obviously it's amazing. So he's blue now. And I'm blue but our main damage source is in blue so that's good Santa is our main damage source and he's not blue so that's perfect for us just in case he didn't know So he's going after him again. So this is perfect. Me and uh, Santa, two main damage sources. Could just wail away on him for a bit. <clears throat> As you can see, the health dropping extremely fast because we're doing double damage right now. So you want to stop a little early because he switches your hat. And if you don't stop a little early, you'll end up healing him for a lot. And you definitely don't want that because time is definitely a factor in this boss fight. So he's red now. So this is the one hit KO that he does. If he lands on you, you're just going to want to dodge him. So far, so good. I mean, standard stuff, but I mean, we're getting it done. He gets really hard at his last 25%. That's when he's most difficult. So he's still pretty easy for now. And I'm I'm just glad he's staying on the um, 
the zero in the corner because this is perfect. Like we couldn't ask for a better situation. I'm gonna just use everything I have. So I'm doing like 12 mils, 14 mils even. Got to stop a little early because you don't want to end up healing him like I said. All right. Halfway done and we have more than half the time left. This is exactly what we want. Give Santa sharp eyes. He's red, so I could attack him now. And zeros, yeah, they don't they don't really die even if they get hit by one hit KOs. There's a small chance that you'll live his one hit KO with one HP. I can't remember it's it's kinda like a glitch. It's not supposed to happen. Ooh, I just healed him for a bit. It's not supposed to happen, but <clears throat> sometimes it does and I can't remember why. But since I have aggro, I'm just going to stay in the corner for a bit. Uh, okay, I'm blue. I'm going to attack him. Oh my god, he's invisible. Sometimes he glitches like that. That's the thing about Pierre. He'll glitch sometimes like that. And whoa, I just like landed on a hit. Thank god I didn't die. So even Santa was informing me that he glitches sometimes, like I just told you guys. It's annoying when he does, but there's nothing you could do about it. And you're definitely going to want some all cures when you're facing this guy. Oops, almost went into that. So this is perfect right now. The, again, though, he, he's well, his hardest part is coming up, but we have perfect amount of time to actually beat it, so that's that's good. <laughs> I was like, screw you guys, because he's just tanking. Alright, he switched. That's why I wasn't attacking, because I didn't want to heal him. I love how he just keeps going after the zero. He's going to split soon, very soon actually. But we all have a lot of lives left, so that's... Oh, there you go, he split. So the person that has the aggro for the blue one, the person that has the aggro for the blue one, you want them to die in the corner and just stay dead so that they, the blue one can stay away from the red one. And that's exactly what you what you need. I don't know why it didn't work, because the blue one's still supposed to stay on. The blue one's still supposed to stay on freaking the zero, but I don't know what happened there. Whoops. Well, 
What happened? I'm very confused. I I don't really know what happened because, huh? Whoops! I just healed the shit out of this guy. my life this is the change this is definitely the change This is extremely different from how he used to be. He's a lot harder now, like... This is extremely difficult. Sorry for not talking too much. I'm just really... Damn. I think if we die, we lose the hat. Meaning we could attack anyone we want. Nope, we still get a hat back, so that's just completely awful. God, the first, like, what, freaking 80% of this boss is completely easy, and then the last, the last 10% just completely ruins everything. I'm probably dead here. Yeah. Yep. Oh, what a close run. I I didn't know the the changes were like this. Holy crap. Man. I I feel it's still really easy with six people. But frig with two, three people very difficult because I'm actually really stressed out right now because we had a really good run so I'm gonna look for the red one since I have a blue hat I'm gonna just wail away at him and since my arrows fly out of my ass like nothing oh boy This is extremely difficult. Oh my god. It's so hard because you... Ah! Sick. <laughs> is this even possible? Because we're going to be attacking the wrong... Like, it's just so hard to focus on one freaking clown when they're both going all over the place and it's just oh my god and I keep healing them Jesus I'm so mad actually I'm actually pretty pissed off cuz this is this is actually like giving me a headache I just don't understand how they expect someone, you know, to kind of do this crap. And then the hats drop like 20 at a time. So the zero has aggro for both of them, which is horrible because now I can't attack any of them. Well. 
Thank you guys for watching. This has been a sofa production. <laughs> a dreadful production, I'm going to say. And yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. The first, well, I don't know, 10 minutes anyway. Because this, that, that was absolutely stressful as shit. Good. Oh. Alright, guys. <laughs> I feel like just off that alone, that that made my day feel so long. But thank you all for watching. This has been a dreadful production. I'll be seeing you all later. Peace. If you liked that last video, why not click another? You might like that one too. And don't forget to subscribe.